EU to have to cross the border to find different types of currency, right? Well, not anymore. James Myers drove about 20 minutes down the road and tells us what you can buy with a Davis dollar. It's a local currency that in encourages people to spend locally in Davis. Community currency is not a new idea to bolster the local economy. During the Great Depression, stamp scripts became very popular. Davis dollars have a one-to-one -one ratio. One Davis dollar can be purchased for one United States dollar. So how does this help the local economy? You take some Davis dollars and you go to Ken's Bike and Ski and spend it there. The owner there is probably going to spend it at Monticello Seasonal Cuisine and buy himself a meal there. And then she's going to go to Copyland and make some copies for her business. And he might come to the food co-op and spend some money here. And so it's a way of, of guaranteeing that down the line, all that spending is going to stay in Davis. Of the 25 local stores that accept Davis dollars, the Davis Co-op is the most recent. It's a big thing for us and to have someone create something that allows us to keep our money here and show that we're committed to community development, I think it's a good thing. And here at the co-op we're extremely excited to have it. People are really excited. They see it in my cash drawer and they're like, oh, can we get Davis dollars back? I say, sure. So we went to the streets to find out what Davis citizens think. Have you heard of Davis dollars? No, I haven't. No, I haven't. I think it's a really good idea. Uh, it sounds a lot like Aggie Cash to me, but I think it's a great idea to keep the money in the community, kind of improve local economy. Spend one dollar at a, a big box store, then only about six, six to ten cents of that stays local. And if you spend that same dollar at a local mom and pop shop, about sixty cents stays local, so a lot more. And I like to point out to people that if you spend one Davis dollar locally, then a hundred cents of that stays local. All right, and Davis isn't the only place that does something like this. Communities in Brooklyn, Philadelphia, Portland, and Ithaca, New York have had their own currency for decades.